I started using Shani because I had just started speaking, I got on stage for the first time, and I thought I, I failed. And by failing, I mean I didn't capitalize on the opportunity to the extent that I thought I could have. Uh, and I realized that every time I get on the stage, it's an opportunity to either do great things or to absolutely kill my personal and professional brand. So I take that really seriously, of course. So I, I contacted Shani and she helped me get more organization in my message, uh, have a message with a greater sense of purpose, uh, and then ultimately make me more confident in presenting that message. And collectively, those things did come across into a better overall message and frankly, better results after. So after the first message, after my first presentation, wasn't asked, asked to speak. Uh, I didn't all of a sudden get a bunch of emails and calls, will you speak at this meeting and that meeting? Uh, but shortly after starting to work with Shawnee, I'd get off the stage and every presentation would lead to two more. And every one of those would lead to two and three more. And it's, uh, it's a great opportunity in business uh, when you can be an opinion leader on a podium like that. Uh, I think people respect that. And so Shawnee helped me get the most, uh, make the most out of that opportunity. Was there a moment or a quick story you can share where you, where you know her efforts uh, were worthwhile? Was there a defining moment or was just all good? Yeah, I, well, I mean, you know, again, so you, I wouldn't have been able to just call Shani and say, hey, come on over and help me with this presentation. And then she comes over and helps me with it and it's just genius instantly. I think that we had known each other for a while. She had worked with me for a while. She understood my style. And so when I had a presentation come up, um, when she was able to help me with that, we didn't have to go through the six weeks of learning about each other and her learning my style to make it count. She was able to come in, come up with a theme for the presentation and organize the topic around a theme that made it, um, for this audience, what I needed, which was educational and, uh, and, 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 and entertaining. So she was able to do that instantly because we had the history together already and we just knocked it out of the park with that presentation yeah. and it was great. And your advice to others who are considering people like Shawnee and their expertise, what would you tell them as they compare and contrast uh, their options to, to get that kind of help? Well, I think the first option is not to use anybody at all. I think that by default you think if you have, uh, you, you know, you think that you have the tools, you have, a, uh, you have the ability to write a presentation, rehearse it and go deliver it. So the first decision is, do you bring in someone to be a consultant? Uh, and I think that that's, it's absolutely critical. I might have a screwdriver, but it doesn't mean I know how to fix my refrigerator. It just means I have a screwdriver. So just because you think you can do it, it doesn't mean you can. And then when you're looking at professionals, I think much like what you want to communicate to your audience, authenticity and, and genuine, uh, Shani brings those things to the table. So whereas a lot of people do it as a profession first, I think Shawnee does it as a passion first, and I think that that shows in, in what she does and the results that you get, and I don't think you'll find that too often.